Hey everyone, it's nice to see you again on all s such short notice. We know we ha all have our, our daily lives that we are, are really busy, but it's, good, it's always good to come in these dark times in our lives, but, you know, we all get to talk and connect with each other, and yeah, that's what we're going to do today, and I'm going to meet with another group after this, and someone's going to have to share something personal, and we're just going to get some feedback on them, and try and make them feel better. So who would like to go? I'll go. So basically, you know, I have my regular life. I got my job done, you know, I'm working and everything. Paying the rent, paying the bills. It's just all been very stressful on my mind. Usually I have my family members there to guide me and help me out. You know, like stuff like that. It's it's normal for people to get have stress and stuff. But for me... Fa having family was my number one thing and not having them around anymore just made me really depressed and my my life wasn't I wasn't up to myself these past few years it's been really tough on me thank you Carl for sharing that it's really tough to say all that stuff in public but we all have to remember we are not alone even though after the dial snap life is hard on us like all the time but we just have to remember the world is in our hands we gotta make something of it you know we were just lucky enough that we survived the snap so how is life for you now okoye i mean not too bad i guess without um t'challa it's not the same anymore without a king but trying to make the best of it you know yeah i know what you mean well we all got signed up. So see ya. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. So, some people move on with their lives, you know, after the snap. Some do, but not us. It's really tough, you know. I'm, at least I'm trying to do something with my life. Guide these people, make them happy. I, I'm, uh, make them feel like they have a family, that they, people they can talk to. Well, I'll see ya. Just remember, Romanoff, you're not alone. You have me, you have the Avengers. You're not the only one that's depressed at this time. Where the heck am I? Man, how stuck was I in the quantum realm? Where is everybody? Am I lost or something? Hello? There's no one here. Jeez. Where's everyone? Wait. Cassie! 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 Open the door! Open the door! Cassie! Are you in there? Open the door! Dad? Oh, hey, Steve. So, you back from work? Yeah. Same old thing. Trying to help these people out. Dude, I'm doing the best as I could. You? Yeah, taking care of the Avengers headquarters. You know, this is not easy. I know. Half your man is gone. What else are we going to do? You know, we got to make the most out of our life right now. Even though it's not really the best for us right now. That else won. Yeah. Something we have, I'm still digesting to. You know, it's really hard not having those other Avengers. Just It's just not fair. You know, you don't tell them this but to the other people. But personally, I don't know what to do. I know, we can't even reverse it either. That's the sad, saddest thing about it. Yeah, I agree. Well... At least, you can keep me company, I guess. 
<laughs> yeah, true. Uh, Steve, you might want to look over there. Huh? Hey, it's me, Scott Lang. I don't know if you remember me. I teamed up with you guys like a decade ago to stop Tony at the airport. Anyway, the reason why I'm here is because I think I know a way we can reverse the snap. So can you bust me in? Shall we? Let's do it. Alright then.